Greetings and salutations. My name is Tisha and welcome to the Artist Haven, where home plus art equals heart. In tonight's live video broadcast, it is Testing Tuesday. <laughs> you always do that just that wee bit early, Michael. That's what makes it fun. <laughs> Keeps everyone on their toes. <laughs> I suppose. Anywho. Tonight we are going to be testing out my version of satin enamel deco art, satin enamel cloud, or you can use it for pearls or you know, whatever effect you're going for. Um, I do have a video down in the description box below on how I mix this with Floetro. And basically all I did was, this is Dutch Boy Forever Satin acrylic enamel in ultra white i pay uh normal retail price on this i think is 15 dollars, and this is like 30 ounces 30 fluid ounces which is a, like a little over a pint so um yeah like a pint and a quarter or something anyway um but I've always buy it on sale, 11% off or 15% off or whatever. And sometimes they have it even less, like $10 for that. So it's a lot less expensive than the satin enamel paint. And then I mix that with the Flow Acrylic from Artist Loft. And um, I usually mix it in its own bottle. And then I mix it with the pouring medium of choice. And tonight, that will be Mix Bum Bum Bum. <laughs> pouring medium which I need to get my hands on some someday anywho we're going to be using mixed media girls uh, du dual split cup um, I have links for that in the description box as well same with mix and also we're going to be using some porridge posse too bad, green, too bad Brian's not here. I'm using his annoying green from Porridge Posse. I'm also going to be using Prussian Blue from Master's Touch, Prism Violet from Liquitex Basics. Of course, we've got to have some 24 karat gold in there, and that's Deco Art. We already said the Porridge Posse annoying green. Uh, the Flash Red, Red Flash from Folk Art. Um, I'm going to do all the colors on one side and then I'm going to do the whites, the white on the other. That's what's in this bucket. But I'm going to squirt some unbleached titanium from Liquitex Basics in there and also some iridescent white, which is a combination of um, Sargent Art iridescent medium and Amsterdam titanium white. So I'm just going to kind of pour, fill it up and then squirt some in there. So it's just kind of intermixed. <laughs> No, that's what he said, honey. There we go. <laughs> so, while I'm getting the cup ready, why don't we say hello to those in chat, Mr. Michael? Hello to those in chat. There we go. Hi. You know, we got a lot of people in chat tonight, ah. and we are so glad you're here on a Tuesday sharing your Tuesday with us. Or if you're like Sue Ashworth, cross the date line, your Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Happy Wednesday, Sue. <laughs> and yes, Sue Ashworth, Resin Heaven Studios, is here tonight. And there's our moderator, the lovely Doris, Doris at DF Designs. Hello, Doris. Yeah, she just had her live a little bit earlier, and then we go into this one. Gosh, everybody's, we have all kinds of fun. everybody's having fun tonight on YouTube. So Samantha's here tonight, Twisted Art Lady. Hey, Sam. Krista's here. Hey, Krista. Hey, Krista. Um, I am seeing GE Art 20. Hello, 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 hello. Welcome to the channel. So glad to have you here. And there's Mel Firestone. Hey, Mel. Shannon's here tonight. Shannon Shack. And let's see who else is Anita. Uh, Hi, Nita H. Hello. Hello, she says, another says hello to everyone. I think she's new. I, I don't remember seeing her before. Welcome, welcome. Welcome. My Fox's baby cakes. That would be Cynthia. Cynthia. Hi, hello, Cynthia. Cynthia. And let's see who else do I see here? There's Virginia. Hey, Virginia. Hello, hello. Patricia's here tonight. Hello, Patricia. 
Saucy Creations Art. Hello. Hello. Wonderful Welcome. to see you. And I see, let's see. <laughs> who else? Oh, there's Mona, our flow by Mo. Hey, hey Mo. Mo. <coughs> Excuse me. Goodness, where'd that come from? Let's see. Janice Pittman is here. Hey, Janice. Hello. And gosh, I know that there's others in here. I don't have the chat up, so we're relying on you, Michael. Yes. Oh, I saw Sarah here. Hello, Sarah. So glad you are here. Awesome. Awesome. And let's see. If there's anyone that I left out, tell you what, jump in the chat, let us know, and we will give you a shout out tonight. Absolutely. freaking um, Let's do a little bit of the blue. Okay, so this cup is 10 ounces, which is about what I need for, I'm going to be doing a 12 by 12 level three uh, canvas for Michaels. So I need about 10 ounces of paint. So we're going to do 10 ounces of color and 10 ounces of white. So this red flash kind of sticks around. It's pretty. It's kind of that. There's Christina Welch. Hello, Christina. Christina. Hello. I'm using Brian's green and he's not even here. <laughs> Somebody get a hold of Brian. <laughs> I, you know what the thing is, is what's funny is I, I, when I was mixing it, I'm like, this isn't Brian's green. This is Grinch green. And I'm like, well, maybe Brian is a little bit of a Grinch. I don't know. You know, at the end of the movie, he turns out to be a pretty cool guy. So, hey. Hmm. Hey, today's Groundhog's Day. Yes. Groundhog saw his shadow. Yes. So six more weeks of winter. No. To me, that yeah. means six more weeks of groundhog hunting. <laughs> Do I yeah. need to learn to look up a recipe for groundhog? Oh, I'm sorry. That's, go that's, go that's gopher. That's oh. it. That's oh, yeah. That's gopher. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's when I do my Bill Murray imitation. Okay. Also, it's Tuesday, which means. Uh oh. Mm, what does it mean? <laughs> oh, Patricia, yes. Are we doing trivia? I don't know. Should we? <laughs> well, you know, here's I'll, the thing. I'll ask in the chat. Should we? Should we? I don't know. Mm. Good question. <laughs> Oh, Michael, being Su with Su you is Su such a pleasure. Trivia. Yeah, but might, maybe a little bit. Hmm. <laughs> oh, don't tease. Christina says yes. Don't tease. You're the trivia guy. You know, you're, you're the walking encyclopedia of all this oh, knowledge. No. Sam, Sam says it's testing Tuesday. It's so. testing Tuesday. Oh. Okay. Well, we could do testing t Tuesday and trivia. Because, you know, you got to do something while I'm fiddling with all this paint. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, <laughs> Mona's son is having a birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Mona's son. I would sing, but y'all would tune out really, really fast. So, Sue says testing Tuesday with trivia. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're going to have a poll on that later later on, and um, we're going to be, start being a little bit more active on the community tab. We are getting into the new year. Yes. One of the things that we got in the works is membership, and I got this lovely flu bug thing going on with my body right now, so I've been not able to focus on things for very, very much. So I'm trying my best. Yeah. And <clears throat> with the fact that you've got a little creeping crud. Yeah. You're going to have to have to relax a little bit. Just take a little. Easy. Yes. I, so. I, I'm, not, I, I'm not one of those people that knows how to take it easy, though. Virginia's question is, what is Doris's favorite color? Really? 
Is that even trivia? Hey, if you're new to the channel, they wouldn't know that. <laughs> so Question is, is what's that's my new, favorite try channel? To guess. <laughs> what my, is Doris's favorite color? What's my favorite color? Hmm. There you go. There's a couple of questions right there. All right. So we're gonna. <laughs> Doris says that's an easy question. Yeah, if you if you've been here before, if you're new to the channel, you would know that. So, and for and let me say also, if you're new to the channel, welcome. I'm so grateful that you're here. If you are enjoying our little vibe and want to join a creative tribe, all you gotta do is click that subscribe, hit that notification bell because we go live five days a week right here on this channel, and. We have so much fun doing it. You don't want to miss out. So. So I see Darth Haster is <gasps> in the chat. Darth, Darth. I haven't seen you in a coon's age. Long time no see. Awesome Hello, to Darth, see you. Glad you are here. There is Monica. Monica's creativities. Hello, Monica. Hello, Monica. Wonderful to see you too. So everyone is Ooh. saying that your favorite color is purple. Yes, but there's a specific purple. Hmm. Not a Pacific purple, a specific purple. Interesting. Okay, I'll tell you what. <laughs> anybody how about, guessing, anybody how guessing about what color one is? One trivia question. Just we'll do a quickie. <laughs> hey, hey, that's not fair. <laughs> so, hey, Naptime Creations is here. Hello, that's Tish number one. I, that that's been her nickname. Christina for says her. morning pansy purple. That's my favorite porridge posse purple. Yes, I love that color. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, do I love that color? I would use that in every painting, but I treat it like it's gold. Okay, so we're gonna put this down as a just a little bit of a puddle to pour in, so I have something to okay. aim for, because you know I'm a girl and I do have that. Guess who showed up? <gasps> who showed up? Brian. <gasps> Brian, you I'm using your green, honey. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna put that aside. Okay, so here is a movie trivia question okay. for Don't make me laugh now though. In trivia. <laughs> Cause I gotta pour this. Okay, first off, I need a drink. Okay, go ahead, baby. Okay, so the movie Force Gump. <laughs> Classic. Of course, the actor that played Force Gump, none other than Tom Hanks. But before they ever cast Tom Hanks, they had several other actors that they had lined up. Three actors in particular were lined up to play the part of Forrest Gump. Tell me who those actors are. Two of them are major comedians. And don't use Google. Don't be Googling it or doing the Yahoo. That's cheating. Dora said she texts Brian. Thanks. You. Thank you. Thank you. Sam says, no idea. <laughs> okay, so two of the actors. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, Brian says Steve Martin. It's not Steve Martin. Jim Carrey. No, Jim Carrey is not one of them. Robin Williams. Wow. Good choice, but no. Oh, Monica. Chevy Chase is one of the actors that was originally supposed to play the part. Chevy Chase. Christina Welch, Lisa Wyatt, Bill Murray. Bill Murray is correct. Chevy Chase, Bill Murray.
I think someone actually, yeah. Sue Ashworth got it, and then someone else, I'm pretty sure, had it. Let me see. Yeah, Monica. So the actor that they had lined up, John Travolta. Shut the front door. John Travolta that actually in awful. an interview said he said it was the worst mistake I ever made. Of all the iconic I, characters he's played, but he passed on it. And he said he regrets it to this day. No, nothing so, against John Travolta, but he's not he's not a Forrest Gump kind of guy. But hey, Bill Murray went on to uh, be in Groundhog's Day. I love that movie. I feel like that's my life sometimes. But I'm glad they picked Tom Hanks. So am yeah. I. Yeah, Krista says that it was a good pick. Yeah. Okay. So who is watching Groundhog's Day? Who's going to watch that movie tonight? Not me. I don't have the energy to watch a movie. I'll probably, if I tried to watch, I'd fall asleep. I don't even think I fully, I don't even remember falling asleep last night. I think I fell asleep before I even went to bed. It would have been interesting. Um, John Travolta, Forrest Gump. I, I don't, I don't know how that would have turned out. I really don't. Yeah. All right. We got to fix this little guy right here. There we go. I can't even see the other two guys doing it at all. One more squirt didn't get all the way to the bottom. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> oh, Michael. Oh. So. This, you guys, you guys, this is my life, okay? <laughs> hey, there is Jeff. Hail Jeff B. Live long and prosper. I forgot to turn off the autofocus. Gosh darn it. Yep. We were busy well, stuffing our faces. <laughs> we, were, we were listening to Dorses Live and we were getting ready and fixing up some supper and just been a busy day. And I'm going to clear up this table a little bit here. Somehow, some way. Actually, I don't want to put that there. I'm going to put that there. <laughs> I'm going to put these back where they belong, sort of. There we go. Hey, well, I'll do one more trivia question. Uh-oh. One more. <laughs> you talked him into it, y'all. Since we're kind of we're on the show here. <laughs> the movie Pretty Woman. It's one of my favorite movies from when I was a teenager. So the original actress that played the part, Julia Roberts, of the classic Lady of the Night, hooks up with... Um, Here's your care. There you go. But another, another actress was actually slated to play the part. Name that actress. No, no cheating. No, no Googling it. But this actress was very prominent in the 80s, making a lot of classic 80s movies. Oh, and Brookie Cookie's here. Cookie! Uh, Brooke says, Brooke Shields, great guess. But no. She was too wholesome. She wouldn't do anything like that. You never know. She did she did some some crazy stuff. Yeah, Blue Lagoon doesn't count. Shannon wants to know if it's Gina Davis. It's not Gina Davis, but it looks like Lisa Sue and <laughs> Chris just said Mel Gibson. That's a great answer. 
<laughs> no, several people got it right. It is Molly Ringwall. Oh, no, that wouldn't work. Molly Ringwall was supposed to play the part. Heather Locklear. Hey, there you go. Oh, good Lord. I, I think Mel Gibson would have done a great job. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't want to tip off all the screen because I actually like the screen. I don't think it's annoying. It's just I'm not a big fan of green, but I like this green. And if you put it with a blue, it kind of does some funky stuff, man. Okay. that back up there. Let's move this down this way. Hey, there's Rochelle. She says, hi, everyone. Hello, Rochelle. Okay, I'm going to cheat a little bit. I'm going to help it. There we go. There's Diane. Hey, Diane. Hey, hello, Diane. hello. All right, we're going to take this straight away. Because I think. You know, I think Mel Gibson, um, what was that movie he was in? I think he put heels on. What a girl, what a what a woman wants. That's it. What was the name of the actress that was in that? Uh, wasn't it Helen Hunt? Yep, that's it. Helen Hunt. Joe Namath wore heels. Joe Namath wore pantyhose. And pantyhose. Yeah, he was wearing those to stay warm compared to like before dry wore, fit, you know, and Under Armour was ever around. Well, that and to help so the tape didn't peel off his skin. We watched Joe Namath in a movie from the 70s. <laughs> Got Anne Margaret in it. It's like a, it's a biker movie. It was hilarious. Okay. Yeah, the movie Twister. Yeah, with uh, with her and Bill Paxton. Great movie. Cynthia has questions about the color and brands. Okay. Um. All the all the links, all the colors are down in the description box, except for the porch posse is the Brian's annoying green. Otherwise, I think I have everything else listed down there, except for the, um, the unbleached titanium. I couldn't find it on Amazon. Mm -hmm. I'll probably be able to find it once I like totally sit down and like have my wits about me. Okay, I gotta get these corners, but I gotta get this paint off my hands before I start getting crabby. <laughs> Okay, let's bring out a spatula. Okay. Nice feather. It, it, this is just really freaking cool. Okay, so first we're going to do this corner. <clears throat> okay. Because I've got the green right here. So we're going to take this, take my spatula, and we're going to just kind of Excuse me, shouldn't have drank Dr. Pepper. Now I got the hiccups. There we go. There we go. Help it along a little bit. Yeah, we think Cheryl's just probably not feeling her best tonight. So, yeah, we were talking with her last night. And she's 
still recouping and I, I you know I think we're both still recouping from the Whatever bug that we've had around yeah. here and because uh, my daughter showed up with it so of course you know got to spread the love. love yeah Yeah, that green is looking fantastic. Okay. Flip. Towel. I don't know why I said napkin. It's paper. Right, let me take this. Now, normally I do the corners. <clears throat> I just use my finger, but because this is one of those really thick level three gallery wrapped. Well, all canvases are technically gallery wrapped. Just a little FYI there. So it's a any canvas that goes all the way around to the back, that's wrapped around to the back, is considered a gallery wrapped canvas. Because back in the good old days, they used to staple stuff to the side. And then they came out with these gallery wrapped ones. And Viola. Okay, I'm going to pick at that a little bit. So, touch the edge on that one, bastard. Okay. Hey, you see Lori in the chat. There is Peppermint Paints in the chat. Hey there, Denise, I think her name is. If I remember correctly. I try so hard. If you tell me your name, I will do my best to remember. But there are days where I can't remember my own name. So, <laughs> and like I tell everybody else, if I don't remember your name, don't take it personally. I named my children, and there are days where I can't remember what I named them. So, <laughs> it's nothing personal. I will remember your face to the day I die. But names, yeah, not so much. Okay, so I'm going to tip this just a little bit this way because well, thank you, Julie. You rock lady. I appreciate that super chat. Super sticker there from super Julie. Sticker. Thank you. Super sticker, super chat. This makes for a super awesome person. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay, now I like that better right there. Okay. That, 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 that makes me happy right there. And I just got to wait for the edge to come down. Yeah, baby. Okay. So, I'm going to wipe these edges off. Oh, Krista, you are awesome. Thank you so much. Okay, so I like it like this. This is where my vision's at, but, you know, y'all may have a different thing. I'm not a big fan of that corner, but it's growing on me. I'm going to torch this one more time. 
and then I'll give you all a close up. Then we are going to wrap this baby up. And I'm going to go finish eating <laughs> my chili cheese burrito. <laughs> Because it's the first real food that I've had in like four days. <laughs> Although I did have pancakes and bacon on Sunday. So we had Small's bacon. That was amazing. They have got. Can't beat their meat. That's for sure. <laughs> All right. All right, Brian. Here's your annoying, annoying green in a painting. All right. So let's start with this side. I love the lines in that. I love the little bit of zebra stripes. That is the Prussian blue, and that is a semi-transparent Prussian blue. So this is going to be interesting to see how this dries. Come on, autofocus. You know you want to. But the thing that got me is if you've seen Saturday Night Shenanigans and you saw the tennis racket pour that I did, um, you need to tune in on Saturday um, and see the dried results and you'll see why I wanted to do this. And I, I'll explain on Saturday. So, but look, look that's so cool. Uh, the gold isn't in your face in this one either. That's what I, I like how it does that shimmer. And that annoying green, it's not so annoying. It could be like puce or something, like like more brown green, which wouldn't be really annoying either, because I do like green. Reminds me of being out in the trees. So if you like this video and you're having a good time, please smash that like button. And if you know someone out there out on the interwebs, please share this out there with them. Let them know the jolly good time that we have here on our channel. <coughs> Tomorrow night is Artapalooza, so join us at 7 p.m. Central Standard Time for me and a bunch of my artist friends and Michael um, <laughs> get together and have just a silly good time. And next Wednesday, a week from tomorrow, is the one-year anniversary of Artapalooza, so you're definitely going to want to be there for that one because... We're going to be having a lot of fun and maybe some giveaways. Maybe. I don't know. I haven't discussed it with Michael and I don't know what I want to do. We'll see. It'll be a party for sure, though. So be sure to join us tomorrow night, 7 p.m. Central. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. I appreciate each and every one of you that come here and hang out with us. Sending our love out to Cheryl tonight. Absolutely. Love you, Cheryl. Love you long time. I appreciate especially you and all you do for me personally and for the channel. Thank you, lady. Remember, be kind to one another. Peace, love, and happiness.